we have a current of 0.16 ampere entering the junction. We have a capacitor C and then we have 0.12 amperes leaving. So we have 0.16 entering, 0.12 leaving and we have I1 through the capacitor leaving. Question is what is current I1 in amperes? So if the capacitor has not reached its saturation point, the current is not zero through the capacitor. Again, let's do a fast review. Kirchhoff's junction rule of charge conservation says that the total current entering a point is equal to total current leaving the same point. Current entering is equal to current leaving. And what is current? The rate at which charges flow across a cross-sectional area. I is equal to delta Q over delta T. What is delta Q? Charge in coulombs, capital C. What is delta T? Time in seconds. What is I? Current in amperes. Direction of current is the direction in which positive charges are moving. In a metallic wire, charge carriers are electrons. Electrons move opposite to the current. So here we have 0 0.16 entering, 0 0.12 leaving, and we have I1 leaving. And what is entering? Current entering is equal to what is current entering? 0 0.16. So you say 0 0.16 is equal to current leaving I1 plus 0 0.12. Subtract 0 0.12 from both sides. So you get I1 is equal to 0 0.04 amperes. So current I1 is equal to 0 0.04 amperes. So it is D.